Virginia is recognized. Thank you, uh, Madam Chair. Uh, you and myself, the balance of the time. The gentleman is recognized. Um, Madam Chair, despite our colleagues' claims, the Politics Over Parents Act would only further politicize our children's classrooms while doing nothing to meaningfully improve partnerships between parents and, and educators. Uh, and it will lead to censuring books. Last night at the Rules Committee, a significant amount of time was taken to identify books that ought to be banned. And although the bill does not technically directly censor books, it, the reporting requirements will allow national groups to find books all over the country that they don't like, and they could threaten each of those schools, wherever they find the book, they can threaten lawsuits unless the book is actually banned. House Democrats tried several times to ensure that this legislation would actually address real challenges facing students, parents, and educators, and increase parental involvement. For example, Democrats offered amendments to prevent this bill from banning books or censuring the curriculum. Moreover, in, in committee, we offered 25 amendments to actually improve student success, such as improving access to teacher training, fully fund parent engagement centers, and ensure students have access to mental health resources, among others. Unfortunately, they were struck down. Um, Madam Speaker, Democrats have dedica are dedicated to improving parental engagement and ensuring that every child receives a well-funded and accurate education, but this legislation does nothing to achieve that goal, but only advance an extreme education agenda at the expense of students and parents. So I urge my colleagues to oppose H.R. 5, and I yield back the balance of my time.